What's good, everybody? In this video, we're going to look at two examples on how to interpret slope from a graph or a word problem. Hopefully, this video is helpful for you guys. If it is, smash the like button for us. So problem number one, we're talking about maximum heart rate and age. So when we look at the two points that they give us, we first have to find the slope. So once we set the equation up, we'll have 150 minus 180 all divided by 50 minus 20. And when we simplify, we're going to get negative 30 over positive 30, which is equal to negative 1. Now, the issue here is what exactly does this negative 1 represent? And to figure this out, we just need to look at the x and y axis. So on the y axis, we know we're talking about beats per minute. And on the x axis, we're talking about years. So when we look at this final answer now, what we're saying is hey, as the age increases, we should know that the maximum heart rate by in beats per minute is going to decrease. So as we get older, the heart rate is going to go down. So this is what it means in this problem, or this is what the slope interprets to in the problem. Now, problem number two, they give us a word problem and it says the height of a plant in y in centimeters, I'm sorry, after x days is a linear relationship. They give us two points and then they ask us to find the slope and interpret what it means. So once we set this problem up, we have m is equal to 25 minus 15 divided by 40 minus 30. And when we simplify this more, we're going to get 10 over 10, which is equal to 1. Now, same question again. What does that 1 represent? Well, once we rewrite our answer and we talk about the units, right, we know y represents centimeters and x represents days. So what this means is that, hey, for every day that passes, we should anticipate that the plant is going to grow by one centimeter. So this is what we mean, guys, when we talk about interpreting the slope from a graph or a word problem. How does that or what does that answer represent in the real world context? Hopefully this video is helpful for you guys. This is Algebra One with Mr. Peters. Hopefully this video is helpful. Smash the like button. Subscribe to the channel. And thank you guys for joining us today.